Hey, what is up ladies and gentlemen, it's Cody Carpenter here from the YouTube channel Cody Knows. If you are not subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button below and click the little notification bell to stay up to date with all my future videos. So in this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can easily block any IP address in any one of your Bing Ads campaigns. So you might be thinking to yourself, why would I want to do that? Well, if you're tracking with click magic, let's say you see a you see that your total clicks are at 200 but your unique clicks are at 150 and then if you dive into the stats and you look at a click magic user maybe they clicked on your ad 14 times and cost you like ten dollars or something maybe you want to block his or her ip address so that never happens again so i'm going to give you an example of that so i'm going to go to click magic and i'm just going to go to one of my campaigns that i have running right now so Here's a campaign that's got 112 unique clicks today, and it's April Fools. Happy April Fools, by the way, guys. And uh, the total clicks are 125. So there's obviously going to be some IP addresses that clicked more than once. All right, so I'm into my tracking statistics. Now I can click on any one of these IP addresses, and it'll show me how many total clicks that unique IP address has recorded or how many clicks that IP address has clicked. So if I click on this top one, I can see this top one clicked twice. Um, let's go to another one down here. This IP address clicked three times. So that's a good example. I'm going to copy this and then I'm going to head to my Bing ads campaign. Um, this will all be blurred out. Very protective stuff in here. Um, and I'm just going to go to settings. And then IP address and then just paste it in there and then click save so now that IP address will not have another chance to click on my ads and cost me more money so this is a, a very useful feature to use in your Bing ads campaigns because there's gonna be those IP addresses that really rake up your ad spend because maybe you have a lot of site link extensions you're at the top of the Bing ads search engine results page the very top position and you have a bunch of different site links so maybe someone clicks on your main ad they go straight to the offer then they click back and then they see your site links and it says reviews if they click on reviews but you're just direct linking and again they'll go back and they'll click uh, money back guarantee or all the site links and that just rakes up your ad spend and you might want to block them so I hope you enjoyed this video and if you got a lot of value drop a like uh, once again if you're not subscribed hit that subscribe button below turn on the notification bell to stay up to date with all my future videos I'm gonna be coming out with a lot of content on Bing ads so stay tuned and I will see you guys in the next video